Hi there. <laughs> How you doing? Oh, you got a gathering right oh, now. Look at shit. that. Woo! Two seconds. I'll go outside. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! It's just a regular practice, man. Yeah. Hey, how's it going? How's it going? You guys are looking. At, you guys are looking at my MRI. Yeah. We're, we're looking at the elbow right now. I'm Dr. Ray, by the way. It's nice to meet you, Devin. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, good to Dr. Alex. Uh, I just wanted to just kind of like, just for, for the sake of uh, making sure we're crossing our eyes and our T's, is it okay if I record uh, your imaging and discuss it uh, in public? Yeah, I'd, I'd love that. Sign your consent? Okay. I've, I've, I've loosely spoke about it with some doctors and they're like, Dude, you're a mess. So yeah. I'd love to hear a, a more accurate assessment. Well, I'll say, Devin, you've got you've got quite a bit of a of, of a conundrum you're in with your elbow there. So a couple <laughs> of things. Um, you have a pretty significant amount of arthritis, which you probably already know in your elbow. Um, you got to basically got two elbow joints uh, that basically articulate to make the elbow. Okay, and one side yeah. of it, which is kind of the uh, radial side, which is kind of where most of the force you'll take and what you do in arm wrestling kind of comes in yeah. and you've pretty much gotten rid of most of the cartilage there. So it's pretty advanced, at least intermediate loss, almost high grade losses on some areas as well. So pretty significant arthritis. Um, and then kind of looking at, it's, it's, I, I've had two surgeries on that joint. Two yeah. Surgeries. Yeah. I mean, yeah. with this much oh, arthritis, you probably yeah. have some spurring. I'd imagine that probably, and I'm seeing it after the fact, which is the funny thing. I'm just, he's just like, can you tell there was surgery? I was like, well, there's a lot of arthritis. He's like, well, the arthritis was cleaned up. I said, well, there's still a lot left. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Where? Yeah. No. They actually took out a full cup of bone on the first one. Ah. <laughs> yeah. So it's very significant. Yeah. 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 So basically, a couple of things on your MR. Obviously, you can't see it, so I'm just gonna kind of show it on the video here. Um, you've got a couple of different tendons that kind of attach to to make the elbow. Yeah. Um, and what yeah. we call the main areas that you kind of have like on the inner and outer parts of your elbow It's called the common extensor and the common te uh, yeah. flexor tendons, okay? And yeah. you've got pretty significant um, at least I say intermediate tearing at the insertion of the uh, medial uh, Basically the flexor tendons uh, the common flexor really? tendons. Yeah, I'd say you've got about like yeah. at least a 30 to 40 percent kind of involvement at the attachment site. So you've got an intermediate grade tear already there. And really? Yes, sir. And uh, as far as your other side, kind of like the flexor side, the inside of your elbow, you do have some, some tearing there too. I'd say like another like 10, 20% of the fibers are starting to get involved and there's some edema there. So there's signs that it's starting to tear uh, some of those fibers as well. Not as bad as the other side though. Yeah. Is that, a bad, is that a bad thing? Yeah, I mean, it, 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 it definitely, I'm surprised you don't, you don't grind with your elbow. I mean, you've like pretty much lost the joint. You have all your supporting structure starting to tear. I mean, your elbow is literally about to fall off, man. I'm just kidding. But um, yeah. Devin, is this, uh, is this MRI before or after the stem cell? It's before. It's before I won the world championship. It's like, that's like two weeks before I won. What about with the stem cells? Right, so I had stem cells right, so I got, I got the MRI and then I had the stem cells right afterwards. Interesting. Okay, well, here's another thing you should know about your elbow. I mean, you do a lot of very high, like, very high stress uh, motions in your elbow that require you to have a certain type of pronation and supination, right? So you've actually got a little bit of a uh, marrow stress reaction in your radius, like in the edge of your radius, like right, you know, where it gets to the elbow. It's, it's just signs that you're using your biceps so hard that you're literally ripping the periosteum and pulling on the bone and causing it to remodel and get edema. So the same thing you get, you know, if a runner, like a, like a ultra marathon runner starts to run and they run too much and then they start getting stress fractures in their foot. You're doing the same thing in your radius because you have so much force in your arm. Wow. Yeah. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah. Can you, is the bicep torn as well? Do you see that on Oh, the, wait till uh, wait till you hear about the bicep. Oh, yeah. So, okay. So, I just I'm just kind of going over the uh, bicep part because there's a small like tear kind of like within the fibers itself, like as it's going into the fibers. So, it's not tearing off the bone per se, but within the fibers you have a small tear kind of going through it. 
and there's a little tiny cyst next to it. And it's I'd say like it's about like, you know, almost a moderate tendinosis with like a low gray interstitial tear in your bicep tendon. And you've got a little bit of tendinosis at least involving the brachialis tendon as well. So both of the muscles that flex, you've kind of worn them out and maybe even started tearing the inside a little bit, but they're, they're holding up pretty well. <laughs> Can you tell by the MRI that I'm totally massive, or do I just look? Oh, like dude, you don't even fit in the damn screen. Look at that; like it's all cut off. You you did tear a part of your bicep muscle too, like uh, part of like the outer part of your bicep muscle is kind of like torn and pulled off, like just the outer edges. Because you're so massive, it's pretty much like you ripped bark off the tree. I mean, it wasn't much. I didn't realize that the tendons were were shredded too. That's that's news to me. Yeah, the bicep tendon is not so bad. It's mostly your 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 kind of your your supporting tendons, the common flexor and the common extensor tendons that are partly involved. Yeah. So so like these things can heal, right? They can. I mean, sometimes if they don't heal, I mean, you have a lot of therapies you can do, right? Um, that's what you can talk to Alex about. We have all different types of injections. We have micro needling. We've got, you know, other like just basically a lot of um, non-surgical options. Uh, but you also have, um, you know, tenotomy is an option when things don't work. I mean, certain surgeries can work. But honestly, and the stem cells, I'm, stem cells. I'm, it's kind of interesting that you did it right after and then you won the world heavyweight championship. <laughs> Yeah, I, I would I would usually reserve surgery last option, obviously. Uh, I haven't well, gotten that far that's yet. That's gonna be video number two. <laughs> okay, okay, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no, I was really curious. I mean, I just got, the, the doctor that I talked to basically was like, Devin, you're a, you're a disaster. Yeah. Like, you're a disaster. It's... And we kind of left it at that. <laughs> I didn't really get it, it, it is it is a little yeah. bad. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Devin, did you get to see the? Did you get to? Did he show you the musculature on the MRI? Sorry, say it again. Did the when you read it with the other physician? Did you get to see the musculature on the other MRI? The hypertrophy of the muscles or no? Okay, good. This is a good. <laughs> look, look at this, this is a good view because the musculature <laughs> takes up the whole screen. It does, and it gets cut off. <laughs> It's so massive that it gets, it, you can't even see it in a whole slide of the MRI. Oh, really? We're, we're oh, wait, when, when, I get, when I get into like your forearm or like, man, you got some meat on you. Your forearms are bigger than your arms, it seems like. Damn, like, man, I don't mind. They're both big. What am I talking about? I've been seeing after uh, you do an, another whole year of training, if you ever get another yeah. imaging study done after the stem cells, seeing the difference, you know? Yeah, me too. I'd be real curious to do like... Yeah, to maybe maybe get another one in a year after I, I kind of do this therapy, compare it regular for a while. Get all the blood flow, <laughs> keep competing. Yeah. 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 Awesome. Thanks, Devin. Ah, uh, very cool. Well, hey, thank you so much. It was okay. nice to meet let's, you. Let's, let's let's talk soon and tell me what my hand and wrist look like. Oh yeah, I'm let's do it. See that. <laughs> talk to you soon, buddy. See you, okay, buddy. Guys, thank you. Bye. Bye.